artists that you really like and, and uh, go deep into the music in a way that that artist may never have really tried, you know? So that's one of the exciting things about being a jazz man. It's interesting how, really, any song. I mean, it's like Brad Meldow and a lot of, a lot of, uh, a lot of the jazz cats that I admire that are out there writing jazz today. Um, they can make you know Radiohead tunes and Bjork tunes and all sorts of stuff sound like it works in jazz. And I think Nick Drake is just another example of where it works. People that don't really normally listen to jazz, um, and and open other people's ears to, to Nick Drake's music and kind of kind of bring it all in, and uh, and I think it's making also a statement that jazz doesn't have to just be this you know historical thing. So if you really believe in the progression of jazz and uh, and believe in our paths as artists, um, I think that's I think that's worth supporting. I'm going to support it myself. <laughs> so you should too.